A blind Navy hero and Paralympic gold medalist says he has a little extra help for preparing for the 2016 Paralympic Games, and that help comes in the form of a new guide dog named Gizzy. Ken Pierce is live in Bloomfield this morning, where Lieutenant Brad Snyder will meet with the people who matched him with Gizzy. And Kent, I understand you first met Lieutenant Snyder when he was first getting Gizzy last year. Yeah, that was just almost exactly a year ago, Allie, when I got to meet Brad, when Brad got to meet Gizzy for the first time. Let's give you a little bit of background in case you don't remember back then. Uh, Lieutenant Snyder serving in Afghanistan, an IED goes off, and what happens to you? Uh, well, uh, unfortunately, I, I lost my vision in, a, in an explosion that detonated right in front of me. Uh, but uh, fortunately, I came away with all of my, my faculties and was able to compete as a Paralympian for the U.S. in 2012. Uh, in London. Compete. You won three medals. Yes, sir. I won uh, two golds, one in the 100 meter freestyle, one in the 400 meter freestyle, and a silver in the 50 meter freestyle. All right. You sure don't need any help in the pool, but you came to Bloomfield, Connecticut to meet up with the Fidelco Guide Dog Foundation because you could use a little help getting around where you live in Baltimore. Yes, sir. You know, a lot of the things that uh, are very simple day to day, going to the grocery store, getting a haircut, those sorts of things become very complicated and difficult when I can't see. I can't get in the car and get anywhere, so I needed help gaining my autonomy back, and utilizing a guide dog has allowed me to do that. All right. You met Gizzy a year ago. What kind of change has Gizzy made in your life? It's immeasurable. Uh, the, the confidence that I've gained in, in just my daily life skills is really incredible. And, and more so, it's given my family a lot of confidence to see me go out and succeed and, and be as independent as I was uh, prior to the loss of my vision. And what's next for you? you got the, another Paralympics in two years, right? Yeah, we'll have uh, the Paralympics are going to be hosted by the great country of Brazil and Rio. And I'm looking forward to trying to represent my country again.